The Gulf Coast knows all too well about the devastation a hurricane can create. Over the last four decades, tropical cyclones that hit the U.S. caused an average of more than $22 billion in damages, according to the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. Bowen Kedrevich is in Bay St. Louis, Mississippi, where one storm chaser is on a mission to build a house that can withstand Category 5 hurricane winds. Bay St. Louis, Mississippi has seen disasters like Hurricane Katrina and Hurricane Camille. Storm chaser Josh Morgerman calls this town ground zero for hurricanes. So what better place to build a hurricane bunker? Brick by brick, Josh Morgerman works to create his fortress. He says he's lived through 67 tropical cyclones around the world, including Hurricane Ian. So I've seen this happen a lot in buildings and in houses during hurricanes. Everything's fine until one window breaks, then the wind gets in and it's like a balloon. It just gets in and it starts to sort of like wreak havoc and maybe blow the roof off. To prevent that, Josh partnered with Paramount Contracting to secure the house from all angles. Making sure that the frame of the house is bolted down to the foundation and then making sure that the roof is bolted down to the top plate. Those are some really important things and really focusing on this connecting points with straps, with clips and using a lot of them is just a simple thing that everybody could do. The exterior of the house has a metal roof rated for winds over 200 miles per hour and Josh says the house sits 23 feet above sea level. This is one of the things that's going to give me an edge when it comes to storm surge flooding. So you can see here, this is the floor of the house. It's pretty high up. And what that means is there could be events where the storm surge actually reaches the property, but the house is okay. The Federal Alliance for Safe Homes says the cost to build a resilient home runs up only 1% or less depending on the products used. He's building a home and he's using our nation's highest standards to do so. So we're really happy to see him do that because he's spreading the word of how important it is. Whether or not a home is ever hurricane proof, well, time will tell. But if any house has a shot at being hurricane resistant and hurricane proof, this one does. Construction for Josh's home is set to finish sometime in the fall. Josh says no matter what storm the Gulf Coast sees next, he plans to ride it out in his hurricane house. In Bay St. Louis, Mississippi, Bowen Kudrovich, Fox News.